Today I'll show you how to change your Facebook page name on your computer or phone. However, there's a problem. Quite often people get rejected doing this. So today I'm going to show you how you can do it without getting rejected on both your computer and your phone. So at the moment I'm on my page here. If you don't know how to find your page, you can go to the top right hand corner on your computer that is, and you can see all your profiles here. And from there you can choose the page with the name you want to actually update. Now, this might pop up if you've just been updated, otherwise it might not, just simply click use page. But uh, let's say this is the page I want to actually update. I'm gonna go up the top right again and go to settings and privacy and then settings. Here where it says name, we can click edit and I can change my name. But the first tip is you don't want to just go ahead and change the name to what you want because if you don't have the same keywords or something in there, it can look like you're doing something completely different and Facebook doesn't like you changing the identity of your page too dramatically. So I recommend if I'm gonna change this to say, you know, something like Budo Weekly or something weird like that, I would say Budo Weekly dash previously or formally martial arts designer or something like that. I would try to include that name as previously so that way when people land on the page they know that it's actually that is the old page name and then what i do is leave it for a week or a couple maybe a month or so go back in and remove the remainder of the name that you added the previously bit and then change again that's my recommendation to avoid getting rejected now if you want to learn how to do this on your phone this is also the process so in order to do this on your phone you're going to want to open up your phone and head to the top right hand hamburger icon, click on that, just scroll up and you're gonna see your page name here at the top and the bubbles with the Facebook pages and profiles you have access to. Click on that bubble and then you wanna to scroll to the page that you want to update. So maybe I'm just gonna choose this tutorial test page here. I've got this page up and now I want to change the name. I go to the hamburger icon again and on the top right hand corner, you'll see a cog. If you don't see this, your page may not be updated. And I have a video below which might be more suitable, uh, which I'm linking to the old Facebook page setup. But I click on this cog and it has page settings for tutorial test page. I can see the top there, the name. I press that. And again, I can change my name at the top. So once again, I recommend something like, you know, lessons page or something like that. So I want to change the name to something hideous. <laughs> I would then go dash previously or formally add that in there that will most that means it'll be most likely for you to actually get the name change approved and then in a week or two or a month or whatever you can go back in remove that whole for after you've gone through remove that whole formally tutorial test page and go to just the shorter name you want. So it's a two-step process. Remember, each time you change that page, you wanna click review change. I'm not gonna do it here because I don't wanna change the page name. Um, although this one doesn't really matter, so I can press that. And you'll see that it gives you this little setup. But of course, you do wanna keep that formally part in there. Keep that same page name as part of your page name and you're most likely to get that change. Because each time you include the old page name, so the first time you're including the original page name, Facebook sees that you have the same keywords in your name and approves it. The second time, because you are have your new page name in there, it still sees it as having the same keywords and therefore it is more likely to approve the name. So that's pretty much how to do it on computer and on phone. It's pretty straightforward and easy process. Just remember, it's a bit of a two-step process if you want to guarantee well, not even guarantee, but you know, improve your chances of changing your page name. So I hope you found that easy, simple to follow. And um, yeah, if you have any questions, uh, leave a comment below. I'm not an expert on Facebook, but that's how I've been doing it with the pages I've managed in the past. Uh, so otherwise, hope you have a great day and hope to see you again soon.